Hey, what's going on, you wacky doodles? My name is Frey, and I'm bringing you some weird mode sniping gameplay. This actually happens to be my second gameplay ever um, since I got my Wii U and Black Ops 2 for it. Uh, actually, I was going to send this to Wii Sniper community, but since their message sent to me did say it's supposed to be... They wanted a good gameplay, so uh, this is only a 10 and 9. It's not really a good gameplay, so I, I just decided, you know, I'll just upload it to my channel. I might as well. Uh, I'm still trying to get my bearings with Call of Duty, which is something that's really been uh, angering me. I've been thinking of getting the Pro Controller, because if, if that sustains some relief for me, because I can't wrap my head around it, but I just can't use any of the controllers well, like, it, with every single COD I've ever had. For Wii, anyways, I've been able to. It takes me a, a little bit, and I'm used to it, and I kick ass. Um, that's basically been the same thing on Wii and PS3, but with the Wii U, I just can't get a handle of it. I tried using the gamepad, and my fingers start to feel kind of strained because I have to keep my arms so separate. Uh, I guess they're so used to being cl cl clenched close together, I guess. And the triggers kind of feel really awkward, and I've tried using the Wii Remote, and while that does seem like it's my best bet so far, I just really can't handle the fact that I can't hip fire at all. I don't know if you guys have noticed, but hip firing is extremely hard now, or at least for me it is, and that's really been messing me up. And the Classic Control Pro, it's it's alright, but it's not something I really like, and I'm trying to get my bearings together, because I, I can't play the game well. I've been thinking about getting the Pro Controller, but I've been hearing negative things about it. Uh, I do want to get used to the gamepad, because that seems like that's what everyone is using. So, it's, you know, it's, it's going to take a lot for me to get used to it, and hopefully I can bring you guys a quality sniping gameplay. This one's just a barely positive gameplay using the Wii Remote to snipe for my second game ever with the Wii Remote, and I don't know. I really was outlandishly surprised by how bad I'm doing at this game, actually. I'm, I haven't been doing fairly positive. I mean, I do decent, but I can't even earn my kill streaks, which is surprisingly new for me. Um, so far from what I've seen, it looks like the weird mode's a dying breed. Every commentator I've seen is actually using the gamepad, and they're used to it, which is making me really nervous, but... Uh, if any of you guys uh, could help me out, I'd really appreciate it if you guys just left a comment down in the, in the comments below, obviously, and uh, shared with me what controller you use and how long it took you to get used to it. Because I've been using the Classic Controller Pro and it's it's alright. I could probably put more time into it and get used to it more. So far at that, I'm way more comfortable with the Classic Controller Pro than the gamepad, but I'm really tempted by the gamepad's... Uh, ability to drop shot and that's what everyone seems to be using so I'm really need to get my bearings together I need to start using the gamepad so I can hopefully improve my game so if you guys could help me out just leave a comment below and yeah again share with me what controller you use and how long it took you to get uh, used to it and that's pretty much it um, I want to do something special my first machinima on the Wii U uh, which is gonna be the word fuck which I've done already three times but you know it'll be different because now we have theater so if you guys wanna help me out with that uh, by the way if you guys don't know what the word fuck is it's a pretty funny machinima um, yeah it's it's a pretty funny video uh, where an announcer describes the word fuck and then I get me and a bunch of friends together on Skype and uh, on Call of Duty used to be on the Wii and we just try to set up scenes where it would look befitting. I'm trying to revamp it so it's you know much newer uh, but we'll see how that actually turns out. So if you guys would love to help um, all you have to do is add my Skype Shadow Darkness 2 and my uh, online Nintendo ID which is Crisis Averted that's Crisis Averted Crisis with a Y and uh, just add that up and I'm hoping to do it this weekend and have it out probably by next week. It's going to take a lot of editing, maybe a lot more than uh, I'm used to because I actually want to revamp it and make it, you know, different from the rest, you know, uh, really different. So we'll see how that comes out. But uh, if you guys want to help, obviously, go ahead and leave a comment saying you want to help too. I'd really appreciate any help because I want to make this huge. Uh, as for the top five plays, a lot of people have been asking about that and they will continue. Of course right now I'm really focused on just 
grasping how to play this game well. I mean, on, on PS3, and I know I reference PS3 a lot, but that's because PS3 is like that console. The it's the other console I have the game on, and then I use that to uh, base my other opinions on the Wii U. So, you know, <laughs> for PS3, I honestly gotta say I can play that game backwards with my hands tied to be had a bit back, I guess, and probably still do way better than I can do on Wii U right now. So it's it's really been struggling with it. So that's why I haven't really been focusing on too much other stuff. That's why I've been doing the campaign actually, which is probably why I'm still rank 13. Anyways, um, if you guys want to check out my camp, wait, hold on, I'm getting side, whatever. Um, yeah, top five place. I'll have that up soon. I I just need to like. Cause I want to revamp everything, you know. It's the future. It's 2025, so I need to get a uh, new animations and stuff done. But I've, like I said, I've been really busy just playing the game and trying to get my bearings with it. Um, but I will have that soon, and I hope you guys will can't wait for it. So, it, anyways, uh, I'll I'll have the link and everything. I'll have a proper announcement video for that soon. This is just an update. But anyways, um, okay. I went somewhere else, but now I don't remember where I went. Okay, so about the Wii Remote. Yes, I really do like the Wii Remote. It really feels, you know, unique, comfortable and stuff. And I definitely say uh, it's probably a great thing to use if you want to use a shotgun or a sniper. Personally, I can't use some machine guns very well uh, with the Wii Remote because, like I said before, I don't know about you, but I can't, uh, I can't hip fire at all. Uh, I used to like hit fire without a problem, without even using steady aim, and then people rose to my attention that hey, how do you hit fire so much and do so well hit firing, no scoping and doing all this stuff without steady aim? And I'm like, what? I I I, I never I never used steady aim, which is really cool. And I, you know I saw to myself that man I, I must have pretty good accuracy, but uh, this obviously isn't showing here because I can't, I just can't for the life of me hip fire I, I come into so many situations where I'm close to the enemy and I can't aim down my sights to kill them because I would be foolish yet I mean I'm hip firing and they're hip firing and it seems they can spray endless amounts of bullets and still manage to kill me even though I'm you know I'm trying to like aim at them and actually kill them so I, I don't know I, I can't really hip fire at all so far out of like maybe 20 games I haven't been able to do uh, a really good game where I get all my kill streaks because I just can't manage to, you know, aim accurately enough with the uh, uh, hip fire. So I don't know if you guys are experiencing that too, but I, I definitely gotta start using analog controls. It seems since uh, that's what everyone else seems to be using. I'm not sure how, if if uh, the weird mode even shows up on kill camps, but that's pretty much what everyone seems to be using. Unfortunately, um, I wish they'd actually add a playlist for Weird Mode only. That'd let me, you know, know that I'm not the only one doing so hot with the Weird Mode, or maybe I am. So, uh, yeah. But definitely, sniping and using a shotgun with the Weird Mode are really good. I actually tried playing earlier, and I couldn't do very well with the MP7 or with the limited weapons I have that are automatic, but I, I took out a shotgun and I went on. It kills free. I actually ended up getting most of my kill streaks, anyways, before the game ended. So I definitely do recommend using a sniper and or a shotgun. And I, like I've stated before, there's just that much more pride in getting your kills with the Wii Remote because of the fact that you actually have to aim. It takes more skill, anyways. Um, so <laughs> that was my Wii Remote sniping gameplay, and that was a bunch of announcements and stuff that I talked about. I hope you guys enjoyed and subscribe for more.